Amach, Amos 7. Thus has Adonai Yahuwah showed unto me, and behold, he formed grasshoppers in the beginning of the shooting up of the latter growth, and lo, it was the latter growth after the king's mowings, and it came to pass that when they had made an end of eating eth the grass of the land, then I said, O Adonai Yahuwah, forgive, I beseech you, by whom shall Yahuwah arise? For he is small. Yahuwah repented for this. It shall not be, says Yahuwah. Thus has Adonai Yahuwah showed unto me, and behold, Adonai Yahuwah called to contend by fire, and it devoured at the great deep, and did eat up eth apart. Then said I, O Adonai Yahuwah, cease, I beseech you, by whom shall Yahuwah arise? For he is small. Yahuwah repented for this. This also shall not be, says Adonai Yahuwah. Thus he showed me, and behold, Adonai stood upon a wall made by a plumb line with a plumb line in his hand. And Yahuwah said unto me, Amach, what do you see? And I said, A plumb line. Then said Adonai, Behold, I will set a plumb line in the midst of my people, Yahshadael. I will not again pass by them any more. And the high places of Yitzhak shall be desolate, and the sanctuaries of Yahshadael shall be laid waste. And I will rise against the house of Yaravam with the sword. Then Amatsiyahu, the priest of Beethel, sent to Yaravam, king of Yashadael, saying, Amach has considered against you in the midst of the house of Yashadael. The land is not able to bear at all his words. For thus Amach says, Yaravam shall die by the sword, and Yashadael shall surely be led away captive out of their own land. Also Amatz Yahu said unto Amach, O you seer, go, flee away into the land of Yahudah, and there eat bread and prophesy there. But prophesy not again any more at Beethel, for it is the king's chapel, and it is the king's court. Then answered Amach, and said to Amatsyahu, I was no prophet, neither was I a prophet's son, but I was a herdman and a gatherer of sycamore fruit. And Yahuwah took me as I followed the flock, and Yahuwah said unto me, Go, prophesy unto my people, Yashadael. Now therefore hear you the word of Yahuwah. You say, Prophesy not against Yashadael, and drop not your word against the house of Yitzhak. Therefore thus says Yahuwah, Your woman shall be a harlot in the city, and your sons and your daughters shall fall by the sword, and your land shall be divided by line, and you shall die in a polluted land, and Yashadael shall surely go into captivity forth of his land.